there's something special about places where children are encouraged to dream big. And that's some of what happens here at Girls Inc. I'm so happy to be joined out by Darla Ote Murphy. Thank you so much. And of course, our friend from California Closets, Laura Van Balen. Ladies, I appreciate you taking the time because what happens here is so awesome. Tell me about the history of Girls Inc. and the mission. Yeah, and so let's start with the mission. The mission of Girls Inc. is to inspire all girls to be strong, smart, and bold. Think about that. A girl established in those areas is a girl that's ready to change the world. The history of Girls Inc., you'll be surprised to know, Girls Inc. was established in 1864 as an answer to the Civil War. When I talk about Girls Inc., I often tell the story that even then, it was innovative. Women who were of Native American descent, European descent, and of African descent gathered together to make a difference for women together. Today, they've continued. Wow, who would have thought that the history stretches back so far? And as we flash forward here today, what is it that businesses or even individuals can do to be involved with the mission? There's so many ways, and, and think I think first and foremost, it's getting hands-on, women engaging in our programming, being an example to the girls. We believe that if a girl can see it, she can be it. So volunteering on site, allowing girls to see you and your success is the utmost important thing that a woman could do to make a difference. And that's part of where California Closets obviously comes in. Why is it important for California Closets to be involved with community programs and organizations like this? Well, our, our mission, our value is to design better lives. So as Darla just pointed out, they want to build a better community of strong women that are intelligent and bold. So we align perfectly with that. I think that it's so important for our local businesses or individuals to get involved with programs like Girls Inc. Mm -hmm. just to be the bridge between education and businesses. It builds a stronger and more diverse community and of course it's helping provide resources to build a brighter future. It's so great that you get to do this and California Closets was even a part of the STEAM program that specifically happens here at Girls Inc. Tell me Absolutely. about Absolutely. You know Farron that STEAM stands for Science, Technology, Engineering, Arts, and Mathematics. So one of our goals is to get girls to become leaders in that industry. Every Wednesday, we invite women in to do something that we call Working Women Wednesdays. And in that program, they talk to the girls about their childhood, their education, and what it is they're doing now. That exposes the girls to a wonderful opportunity, again, to see a woman succeeding and dream through her. Well, you have the perfect example of that with Laura being here and you get to work with the kids. Do you have maybe a most memorable moment or an experience? When I first started, I look back now four years ago and laugh how nervous I was. This, I felt so out of my element, but it has become a highlight of my year to work with these girls, show them that they can be their own selves, give them a, a piece of what I do by showing them a little bit of art and design. And of course, I love watching them transform into these bold and smart, courageous young women. I would also have to say, we got to go play on the playground after our lesson <laughs> this, this year, and it was really fun. The slides and the Are girls. Are you saying that was your memorable moment? I mean, it's just one of them I can't pick. Like, I have so many memorable moments, but just honestly, watching their in excitement and enthusiasm is just, it's awe-inspiring and heartwarming. Yeah, there's something about when you can just see their eyes light up and yes. you know you're making a difference. And honestly, I can't believe that I get to be a part of shaping the future leaders of our community. It's, it's just great to be a part of it. Absolutely. What do you say that the, the kids take out most from getting to have examples like this come in? I think, again, as I said earlier, being able to see a woman doing the things that they dream about and connecting with them that the way Laura does, not everybody can do that. That's a gift to be able to reach a child where they are. And so for them, it's taking away a vision that if she can do it, so can I. Thank you for your involvement and of course for all the work that you do. It's a pleasure, thank you.